Catch me on to the scene Riding with the top off Man, my whip's so big when you in it Mess around and get lost And we go to let her head down What the shit cost? Tell me, baby, it's about that life right now So to get this show on the road, we need a few materials. I am using this black, very soft net that I got really, really cheap at the market. And I just got myself about two meters. And then I'm gonna need some scissors to cut up the fabric, a measuring tape to take down measurements I need, and pins to hold down any necessary point. For this tutorial, I'll be working with the basic blouse block because this block is just easy to manipulate and use. I just folded in the excess length at the back and drew in the neckline I would want the top to have in front. So I just pinned it down at the back and sort of to get the real measurement of the top that I want it to be. For the sleeve, I used a basic sleeve block and I just folded in the excess at the back and I'll be joining in the sleeve around the curve on this end here. I have pinned down the excess length at the back because I want the top to have a short sleeve length. To help me visualize and to make this tutorial very easy to follow, I just quickly sketched down the design. It's going to be a simple top, loose fit with short sleeve and a gathered peplum around the waist. So I'm just quickly going to sketch that down here and take down any dimensions I need. So we're going to move on to pinning down the patterns on the fabric. So I'm going to cut out two pieces of sleeve for each side of the blouse and I'm going to cut the front and the back on the folds because it's just a simple t-shirt shape that I want the top to have and once I'm done cutting out those pieces I'm going to dip in the neckline of the front so it can just pull over easily over your head and don't need any fastenings or buttons or zips so once that is dipping it is good to go once I've cut out the pieces down, I should have about four at this point, two sleeves, one front and one back. As for the peplum around the waist, I'm just going to cut out a strip of fabric, which measures about 95 cm by 15. And I'm going to get two, which I'm going to gather around the waist. Okay, let's sew. I am going to be sewing with a double stitch at low tension because the material is really soft and anything hard would just make it gather up. So I'm going to join the shoulders and join the sides. Please ignore the crumpling of the seams at this point. Once everything is nicely pressed at low heat, it would be nicely relaxed and good. After this, I'm going to go ahead to work on the sleeve. So I'm going to take one sleeve, fold it in half, and then join the sides before going ahead to join the sleeve into the body of the top around the curve. So I'm going to go straight ahead and attach both sleeves to the top. For the neckline, I'm just going to fold it in by one centimeter and stitch it all the way around just to knit in it and make it look really nice around the neck once the top is worn. And if you press this down lovely, it will come out really beautiful. So as for the peplum of the top, as I mentioned earlier on, we're going to join those two strips by the side and then sew 0.5 centimeters from the edge as shown here and then taking the loose thread and just pulling that all the way in. What this does is it creates gathers that would be attached to the actual top. I think this is like the easiest way to create gathers in the top, in a skirt or in pants. So I'm going to go straight ahead and join it to the main body of the top. Sewing one CM from the edge, I'm going to gradually attach the gathered peplum to the main top and just sew that all the way nicely around. And after that, the top is finished. It came out really beautiful, really trendy, and I would enjoy styling this for the entire summer and spring period. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this tutorial. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and comment below what you would like me to make next. Until my next video, bye. I hope it ain't talk. No. I could put you in my hot club. What's up? Let's take a trip Have you ever read The World Is Yours?